All right, guys, Model Rocks 321 here, back with another video. We are out for another launch video. Today, we're going to be flying a, a couple um, F motors, a couple E's, and see what it do. But be sure to subscribe to the channel, hit that like button, drop a comment. Um, yeah, and also the SD's discount code, I'm checking on that. So if you guys are new, yours will probably work if you've been here. I heard there was an issue with uh, repeat buyers, but give it a try anyway. I'm working with SD's right now to get that worked out. So the code is IN underscore 321. Fill your shopping cart, put that code in, and get a discount on some SD stuff. So we're going to be flying this Astron Alpha. I upscaled it. It's a vintage rocket from the 60s, but just a bigger version of it. going to be going on the F-44. So stay tuned for that flight coming up right now. Subscribe to the channel. This is Model Rocks 321. All right, here we go. We got the Astron Alpha going on the F-44 motor. Range is clear. Sky is clear. Going in five, four, three, two, one. There it is, way up there whistling. And we have an event, and we got parachute it's coming down. Astron Alpha. Everything is together, coming down looking pretty good. Let me start walking. Coming down right over us though, so this is cool. Nice fast flight on the F44. Nice motor, Aerotech motor. Giving me a long walk, I see. And the smoke, smoke right in front of me. Look at that, that's cool. Smile Rocks 321, guys. Be sure to hit that subscribe button if you have not yet. If you're just finding this channel, hit that subscribe button and become a member. I'll bring you some good launch content, tips, tricks, and everything else. Yeah, this is a good one. F44 motor, real nice. Coming down, everything's together. Smile Rock 321, getting the good weather. Still hot here in Arizona, but it's nice this morning. It is only like 80 something. So this is pretty good. Coming down over near that tree. Check it out. And we're gonna be touching down right in front of me. Touch down, there we go. So if I walk straight, I'll run right into it. Remember, I in underscore 321 over at Estes. Order yourself some stuff, put the code in, Get that discount, support the channel any way you can. It's Model Rock 321. Let's get this Omega. I mean, let's get this Alpha. All right, so here we go. We're going up to get the upscaled Ashron Alpha. Be real nice. Tech, textbook launch on a F44 motor. Here we go. There we go. The motor's still in there. Good. That was a perfect, perfect launch. Everything deployed, got a parachute out. I think that's the old singe mark, but yeah, we did, did good here. Did good, perfect flight right there. First launch of the day, perfect flight, perfect flight. But we are good, we are good. Let's pack this guy up. Yeah, we're gonna take a look at this rocket real quick. See, everything is good, man, that's perfect. I, beat, I made this one all scratch built um, through the wall fins. So the fins are through the wall, so it should, it should land and be good every time. There's the motor right there, so. Model Rock 321, subscribe to the channel, and we will be back with more flights. Oh, Alright, next up guys, we got my Wu-Tang rocket. I took the Red Max and I made it the Wu-Tang. If you know who Wu-Tang is, then you know who Wu-Tang is. That's purple tape right there, if you know what that is. It's Model Rock 321, I'm going to be flying the Wu-Tang rocket on a F-15-4. Coming up right now, Model Rock 321. All right guys, next up we got the Wu-Tang Rocket going on a F-15-4. Should be a nice flight on this one. Going in five, four, three, two, one. There it goes. Nice slow lift off. Four second delay. And we got parachute and he's coming down. Coming down, a lot of smoke on that one, a lot of smoke. Check it out. Coming down right above us, heading in the same direction. Nice slow lift off. I like that lift off on that one. That was pretty good. Coming on down, coming home under that big orange parachute. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Wu-Tang rocket is coming on home. The Wu-Tang Clan. 
one of the greatest hip hop rap groups ever assembled out of Staten Island, New York and Brooklyn. <laughs> A few sections in New York. Model Rocks 321, be sure to subscribe to that channel. That is basically the Red Max rocket. You can get the Red Max. Red Max is one of those rockets you can turn into anything else. If you like the Red Max, you can do that, but it's the chance to have a nice palette to make it any kind of rocket you want. And I took a chance and I made mine into the Wu-Tang rocket. Let's go ahead and recover this one. Here we go. Time to recover the Wu-Tang rocket. Let's see what we got. Everything good there. Yeah, this should be um should be good. I ain't expecting nothing, nothing weird. Oh look at that. <laughs> How? Look at that. It was coming down nice and slow. I wonder if something swung around and hit it. Crazy. Well, we got a little damage. A little damage to the Wu-Tang. I mean, flight was good. Is that a big deal? No, I mean, just gotta... I hey, mean, Wu-Tang is rugged and rough and raw. I don't, I don't mind that. It's just gotta be straightened back out. But, fins are good. As far as reusability. Like yeah, yeah. oh yeah, it can be reusable. It's gotta okay. make sure it's um, straightened out and everything. But yeah, I was expecting zero damage, but that show you in rocketry, like, everything looked good. But I wonder if this snapped out and the, the cone hit it. We can find these cones snap around and hit it, but I don't know how that happened. It came down nice and soft. But that's rocketry for you. That's rocketry for you. It's Model Rocks 321. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. Drop a comment. Also on Instagram at Model Rocks 321. Got some good stuff coming up. Things I can't talk about right now. But stay tuned for more. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do a little something to get this so it don't fit as tight. But. Wu-Tang rocket. That was a nice flight though, the F-44. Alright guys, next up we are flying the Python on an E-12-4. Had a little motor retention issues, so I think I got that resolved. I think I got that resolved. So we'll see what happens. We're going to go for it on this flight right here. Got the Python. Smile Rocks 321. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the thumb up. Drop a comment. And here we go. We got the Python. Going on an E-12-4. Range is clear. Sky is clear. Going in 5, 4, 3, 2, one. There he is. E-12-4 spinning. Waiting on ejection and we got ejection. Parachute is out. Coming down above us. Nice flight. Guess that little bit of motor retention worked. Had to do a little friction fit. Plus the engine hook. Problem was it didn't have an engine block in there. And it was an E-12, a longer motor, so it wouldn't slide all the way inside. If you know what I'm talking about. But coming down real nice. Right above us. Good flight. Nice flight of the Python missile. You can bring that with me this time. Coming down. Real nice flight. That one had a little spin to it. Like a missile. I think, I think the Pythons are air-to-air -air missiles, so they would be on fighter jets and stuff. Coming on home. Coming on home. Yeah, hey, all the rockets headed over this way today. Nice day, man. It's like it's the temperature's not bad yet. Nice flight of the Python. Coming down gracefully. Coming down behind the tree. Let me go over here so you can see that touchdown. Over near the trees. Touching down right there. And just touchdown. There we go. The python is on the ground. All right, here we go. So the python just recovered. Looking pretty good. Got a small little zipper right there. Motor held on. The E124, so yeah, it held on. Has some little retention issues that I was saying, but got it worked out. Everything else looks good. All the fins. I had a nice spin to it. I think it's designed to do that. And there we go. Everything's good. There are no. No complaints. Other than that right there, like I said, these little zippers. Little zippers on him. So that was the Python, guys. And we have one more flight for today. Stay tuned for that one coming up right now. As you notice, it's Model Rockets 321. Subscribe to this channel. Hit that thumb up button. Check the links below also. Support the channel any way you can. Keep bringing you content like this. Drop any questions, comments below. And we'll get back to you soon. It's Model Rock 321.
All right, guys, we are back with the Jupiter C. If you saw the last launch video, you'll know the first flight went great. Then the flight after, two flights after that, I had a little tangled issues. But today, repack the parachute, gonna do it the traditional way, just rolling it up, and we should be good here. This is Model Rocks 321 flying the Jupiter C, and as you know, that is the Explorer, America's first satellite. Russians did it first with Sputnik, and then we did it following them with the Explorer 1. And this is the rocket that sent it. So we're gonna get this going right now. I just saw a spider, he better, he better go away. It's gonna be out to be a launch here, little guy. It's Model Rocks 321. Doing some flights. Here we go, guys. We got the Jupiter C redemption flight going on a C65. And we're gonna be going Range is clear, sky is clear. Going in five, four, three, two, one. There's the Jupiter C. Five seconds. Parachute out. Parachute out. Everything's attached. Looking good, coming down. We are looking good, man. Coming down nice and slow. The classic Jupiter C, very old Estes kit. That you can no longer get unless you go on eBay. Spent about a hundred plus dollars. Look at the Jupiter C coming home. Coming home. And I made a catch. The Jupiter C did not hit the ground today, guys. I made a catch today. Perfect launch day as far as I'm concerned on the C65. <laughs> Oscar's giving me a standing ovation. Show them that standing ovation, Oscar. Yeah, that was a catch. <laughs> the Jupiter C did not hit the ground. Perfect flight, perfect weather today. Like I said, it's been hot, but today it's only like, right now it's 80 something, could be 90 by now, but it's nice. Nice day for flying. Jupiter C, good way to close out the launch for today. I had to get that redemption flight because those last ones were not that great. It's all fixed up. I'm gonna go sit on the shelf for a little while. Model Rocks 321 guys, subscribe to this channel, check the debriefing coming right up, support the channel. Donation links is there, links below, use the Estes discount. It's Model Rocks 321 and we are out. So welcome back friends, Model Rocks 321 here. This is the debriefing you just saw. Four flights today. Four flights started out nice and early. It's in the 80s. It's really nice temperatures, but it's going to climb up today here in Arizona. Um, so yeah, it went really well today. Today was a good day of flying. Um, really nice, really nice flights. So this is just a burnt up on um, the igniter from the Astron Alpha upscale version. Our igniter's all burnt. Wind up grabbing that one, and I found another one too. I found this one here. Sometimes this stuff's hard to find after they ignite but i found this one when i find them i usually pick them up and take them and throw it away so i found those so we'll start out first off we flew the my upscale astron alpha this is a 60s version there's another version that they released that has white fins um this is the version with the red fins it came in a starter set but it was a small kit you know the small the standard size 12 inch sds um starter set Flew this on the F-44, real nice flight. It leaped off the pad really good. Gave that little puff as it tried to ignite. I'm trying to get this motor out of here. Some wants to be stuck, they always get stuck. Let me move this, move the Python until we talk about it. But yeah, um, leaped off the pad really good. It's a nice flight on that one. All the, like I said, all the flights were good today. Everything performed as supposed to. Here we go. So you hear that F-44 Aerotech motor really nice white lightning composite motors are always great um they get off the pad in a hurry real nice with that flame that flame's about i think it's like one and a half feet long it's a long flame that they um produce and um yeah it went really well the plastic parachute was in there it's, it's, it's like a 24 inch parachute deployed and landed perfectly no issues at all very low winds if any wind today so that one went great next up i flew my wu-tang rocket it's the Red Max. It had a cracked fence. I had to break the fence loose and I had to get more glue down in there, but everything is good. They are good. They're not, because when I first built, I had squeaky fins, so just didn't get enough epoxy down in there, but it flew great. It had a little ding on this tube right here, which it seems to be fine now. I mean, I'll fly it again. Like I said, this rocket, 
it's not supposed to be a pretty pretty rocket anyway so i don't mind all the little dings and dents it's going to get but yeah it had that little market like it i don't know if it's coming down really slow under that parachute but i don't know if it happened from the cone and i was looking at the cone to see if i could see if it swung around and hit it but i don't see anything that matches that crimp right there but overall it's great flight let's get this engine out of here this is burnt motor i like this retention this is great that's you know, simple and great so here it is yep f14-4 motor black powder motor by estes which be sure to use the discount code um keep trying it guys um in underscore three two one put put stuff in your cart add the code at estes website and um do your payment method and you'll see a discount happen so that's those two next up i have went with the python the python python missile so it's this guy right here all these rockets are fairly big so they can't really fit on the table like that um this flew nice on the e 12.4. I was having retention issues. There's no motor block in there. I forgot. And I um, just had to do some tape retention to get the motor to stay in. But it stayed and it launched on that E12, that long burn. And the ejection happened and it went great. I did get a little zipper here, a little ding, some kind of dent right there. There's out there one previously and then this one. So I'll get that fixed. But it flew really nice. It gave a spin. I'm not sure if that's from the shape of these fins. I can see the fins have sort of a, no, the fins are really good. They just have that, that wedge shape. It's like a wedge on this side, a wedge on this side. I forget the shape of this um, fin here. It's like it's been sanded both angles. But these are plastic fins, so I don't know. Um, I don't know. Just had a nice spin. It was spinning the whole way up. I can see it from the very beginning. Um, so, yeah, really nice. Really nice flight of the, of the Python. You can find one of these. These are good flyers. Good flyers. 24 millimeter. Probably would be a really nice 29 millimeter also, but... It went great. It went great. Another great flight. Can't get this out of here. This is all taped in, so I'm about to spend some time. Let me see if I can even... Yeah, this is really... Yeah, it's stuck in there pretty good, so I have to use some pliers and everything to get that motor. But great flight. Great flight of the um, Python. And last but not least, I brought back out the Jupiter C. I just know that that's a great flying rocket, and I didn't understand like the last time how those parachute was just... Just wanted to get stuck that day. The first one went great out of the last launch video. Then after that, I had two tangles. Just just weird. Just weird. But today, it performed great. I didn't have any more C53s or I couldn't find any. So I went with the C65. And it worked out well. Everything well. Everything strong here. Landed great under parachute. I had glued that rudder piece back on. Touched it up with the flat black paint. No zippers. Everything's good. It's the old zipper right there. Yeah good perfect satellite everything's in place and it went great really nice flight of the jupiter c america's first satellite launch vehicle so you see those ue markings and there's the fins got the motor out here's the motor which is the c65 everything was good good day good day at the launch field those are the kind of days you want some of those days are nightmare days. You know, this hobby is weird. Only only injury was really on the Wu-Tang rocket, and that was right here, that crimp. But like I said, I'm not worrying about that. I'm not even going to repair it. I'm going to fly it again as is. But yeah, guys, these were the four flights for today. Astron Alpha, the Python, the Wu-Tang Red Max, and the Jupiter C. This is Model Rocks 321, guys. Subscribe if you made it this far. If you're not a subscriber yet, hit the thumb up button. You can copy this link. There's a copy link button. You can send it in a text message. Send it to a friend, send it to somebody you want to get involved with the hobby to check the hobby out. It's a great hobby. And um, that's all we have for today. So see you guys on the next video. It's Model Rocks 321. Subscribe. And stay tuned for the next video that's coming up right here.